Hi YouTube! Uh, I'm going to talk to you today about uh, my first Hermes purchase. Um, and it is a bag that I, um, I saw a few years ago um, on uh, someone that was going into my office and I really loved it. Didn't know what it was uh, at the time. Did some research and found out that it was the Hermes Evelyn, Evelyn bag. So, of course, I saw the price at the time, and I was like, eh, no way. <laughs> but over the years, um, as I've gotten older, uh, I have um, started to like the more high-end luxury brands. So when I saw this bag, um, it was in January, and um, I was going to actually purchase it on the Hermes website, um, and then go pick it up at the store so I can get the whole Hermes um, experience, Hermé, Hermes, however you say it. Um, but it, at the time on the website um, in January, it was right before the price increase. It was 3200 or 32 and change. Um, and I was going to bite the bullet. The, the tax was going to be ridiculous. I was going to buy it. I, and I work in New York. I was going to buy it and then pick it up in Jersey to save a little bit on the tax. But then I, you know, I, I started looking at the consignment shops, the, um, the websites like Fashion File and the real real and guilt.com and blue fly and they all had the pm uh, the one version and i really wanted the three the pm uh three which is the one that has the adjustable strap and um the pocket in the back so i so i actually went on ebay and i started flipping then i also wanted the um the signature color the orange color so I went on eBay, I was flipping through all of the um, the ones that were there, and one particular uh, bag caught my eye. It was like 3.30 in the morning. Uh, my son had woken up, so I, um, and I had to give him a bottle. I couldn't go back to sleep, so, you know, <laughs> that is when I trolled the internet. And I looked at it for a couple of days, then I emailed the woman and I asked her, um, you know, would she be willing to negotiate and come down in price, and she did. So I really got the bag at a great deal and then a couple of weeks later Hermes raised the price. I believe the price of this bag now is $3,700. So I didn't mind that it was from eBay at all. She, it was it was really new. I was really comfortable. It was it was written really new. It was new. The bag was new. It came with the tag, the dust bags, one for the strap, one for the bag. It came with the ribbon. She even included the little sample um, perfume that they gave. It came with the actual shopping bag from Hermes. And um, I was just really comfortable with her. She was an older woman and she said her husband had bought her two, two of these bags, God bless him. <laughs> and she, this one had just been sitting in her closet. She never touched it. She never used it. Um, she sent me lots of photos. I authenticated the bag. Perfect. And here it is. So this was my Valentine's Day gift to myself. It's already taken out of, um, it came wrapped, it came with the, the ribbon. It was as if Hermes had sent it to me in the mail. I have not worn it yet. And, you know, I truthfully, let's show you. Okay, so, so this is, this is the bag. Beautiful bag. I believe this is the Clemence leather. And like I said, it has the back pocket. This is the PM size, which is pretty big. Um, and, uh, of course, I have to have a poof on it. I will leave where I got this poof uh, below. It's an alphabet poof. It has my initial on it, A. Um, so, and it just came with everything. There's the air paper. And you take out the air paper, and it's just a big black hole. It has the H, which is actually, this is, the, this is actually supposed to be the back of the bag. I'm not sure why Hermes designed it that way, but... They are Hermes and I am not, so it is um, just a one, a one compartment, and then it has the back compartment, well, this is actually the front of the bag, but pretty much everyone wears the H to the front, um, and then it has the, the snap over. Uh, underneath uh, is the date code, which says, I think it says, I can't even read, it says P8 or something like that. <laughs> and then um, there it says uh, Hermes uh, Paris, made in France. Great squishy leather. The strap is canvas. 
um, and it is adjustable. Um, now I had bought the bag, oh, and on the strap here as well, it says as well in silver, Hermes made in France. I had bought the bag in January, um, and I didn't, uh, I did open it just to make sure everything was, um, legit with it, but I didn't truly, um, open it until I, and I wrapped it back up and everything, and then it was my, like I said, my Valentine's Day present to myself. Now, I haven't worn it since, and I'll show you really quickly. If you wear it, hopefully you can see, let me put this down. This is it, that's the bag. Oh, it's just on the shoulder, and then of course, it is a crossbody bag. So that is how it looks, crossbody, hope you guys can see. I love, love, love the leather. It looks like it will fit massive amounts of stuff. <laughs> um, I don't know if I had, I had a bit of buyer's remorse um, <laughs> with, with the bag afterwards. I haven't worn it yet, and quite truthfully, I am still thinking of selling it. I don't, I don't know. Maybe because uh, I didn't want to wear it in the winter, I'm still waiting for the weather to get a little warmer, but I haven't worn it out yet, um, and I don't know. I don't know if I'm going to keep it or not. You know, you want something for so long, and then when you get it, um, you're kind of like, eh. So I don't know. I'm still up in the air about it, but I do think it is a gorgeous, gorgeous bag. It is a great piece to own from Hermes, which is uh, probably the only piece that I will ever earn, own from them. I do not, the Birkins are great, but um, again, just like Chanel, I believe, I, for me, Birkin is for the accomplished, older, mature woman, you know, someone who's in her 50s and 60s and she's conquered the world and she's got herself a Birkin, you know. So maybe that'll, I'll, you know, when I'm 50 in, in my 50s or 60s, I will get a Birkin. But this bag, um, I thought, would be the best thing to own from Hermes. It came, like I said, with the, the dust bag for the bag. It came with the small dust bag for the strap and it was all wrapped in there. It came with, um, a little, uh, it was so cute, a little postcard, um, uh, it, it looks like it fell out now, but with the, the armor sample perfume, um, and the seller just said January 12th, 2016, dear Amy, thank you again for your purchase, I'm sure you'll enjoy wearing your Evelyn for years, um, and then her name, it's a pretty little, uh, postcard, uh, with a Paris, uh, scene there. And then it came with the, uh, I believe this is, let's see, I believe this is, yes, the care card. The Elmer's uh, care card. So I was, you know, I'm very happy with the purchase. I'm, I'm, you know, it went very smoothly. And I don't have any regrets with buying it on eBay. I mean, I do, I, you know, everyone wants the Hermes experience, um, especially for your first time. But maybe I'll go in there. And I really want, I saw a picture online um and the girl had turned it into um a true shoulder bag so it was a little it came up a little higher on the waist so i may take it to hermes to um have them convert it for me which means i'll probably have to buy a twilly um but i'm not sure yet um i actually did try to sell to to consign the bag with fashion file and um they quoted me 1800 and i I literally laughed out loud, out loud, um, and I was like, no thanks, I'll keep my bag, thank you. Um, so we'll see, if I do decide to sell it, I probably will go the eBay route, um, but I don't know, I haven't made up my mind, it may sit in my closet for a while, um, but um, that is my Hermes Evelyn. Uh, beautiful, it is a beautiful bag, the leather is beautiful, I think with age it'll get even more beautiful. Um, so let me, let me know what you think, guys. But let me know what you think about the Hermes brand. Let me know um, if you, uh, what you think about the Birkin. And what, let me know if you think I should keep the bag or sell it or just, you know, let me know what your thoughts. So thank you guys very much for watching. Um, my little channel is, I thank you for subscribing to my channel, everyone. And I think for when I reach 100 subscribers, I'm gonna give a, a little giveaway. Um, and I already know what it is, it's just something little, teeny little from Chanel. 
and um, for you guys uh, when I reach 100. So thank you very much for watching. If you have any questions or comments, leave them down below, and I will see you in my next video. Take care. Bye.